Hello and welcome Zamora Gaming fans, I'm your host Joe Zamora here and I am bringing you the first round of the PML playoffs and we have Devin of the Rising Raichus. Alright guys, so we did face off against Devin in the regular season and we did win, I believe, a 2-0. Oh man, super nervous. That battle didn't go exactly as planned, but we pulled out the win. I'm bringing the same exact team... Um, I know he's going to be more prepared for the Berserker, but uh, again, uh, as I said in the last time we battled, um, Berserker really wasn't the Pokemon we were trying to get to win us the game anyway. So let's hope we are good to go versus him this week. And maybe we could do better than the actual Patriots are doing right now. Whew. But good luck, have fun, Devin. Excited to battle as always. Very nervous. Umbreon comes. That's obvious. Uh, probably better suited for the Berserker. Um, hopefully he's running Scarf Drapion again. And we're going to go ahead and try to pop off some big hits with uh, Leonardo leading off Shell Smashing. And then uh, maybe we could sweep up later in the game with Chowder. <sighs> but definitely, it's gonna be it's gonna be an interesting game. So we got Defog for those toxic spikes. We're not gonna be too worried about those. Hopefully, we can uh, manage the Togekiss, not getting too much damage on us. And, of course, Comfey is a bane of my existence in most things. So, as long as we don't let that thing set up, we should be good. Alright, let's get this going. Ah, nervous. It's win or go home, so let's see who goes home here. Alright, so he leads off the same as last time, which is perfectly fine with me. Now, is he scarfed this time around is the real question. Either way, we're going to go ahead and get the shell smash off here. And I do believe he is scarfed. Alright, so he obviously lived um, last time, the waterfall, but we're going to go ahead and go for it again. And I think he was at less health last time, but we'll see. He did get the knockoff off, so our defenses are lowered. We are shell smashed. Plus two in attack and speed. Obviously special attack too, but we're physical attackers, so that doesn't matter too much. Oh man, let's see how he decides to play this. I believe last time he was scarfed and he outsped us even after Shell Smash. I wonder if he is the same set. Oh, so he's, he's going Dynamax here. Burning it quick. Which is fine. I just kind of wanted to break through something as a lead. Blastoise. And it wastes his Dynamax, so it's even better for us. Okay, so we get the waterfall damage off. It's fine. It's not great. And we live it, so we're going to waste two turns of his Dynamax here. Um, let's just go ahead and go for the, you know what, let's go for an Ice Punch. Maybe we get the Freeze, but we for sure get damage. Freeze would be nice. Oh, we get the Freeze! Oh yeah, baby, that is amazing. Let's keep hitting it with Ice Punch so it stays frozen. I'm sure it doesn't work like that, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. Crimson is frozen solid. And he is no longer Dynamaxed. Ok, 
Okay, I'm gonna go for the waterfall here. Should do enough damage. Scarf, frozen. We're in a good spot right here. So Crimson goes down to Blastoise. So, last time around we didn't get too lucky. And this time around we're doing decent. Alright, he's obviously going to Drain and Kiss or Giga Drain. Get that pretty good uh, attack off. Alright, now we're going to go Undertaker, and he's going to feel comfortable enough to Calm Mind. But I'm going to Toxic here. So go for the Calm Mind. Okay, he switches out to Evergreen. So he does go into Venusaur, predicting the Toxic, which is very smart on his part. And let's go ahead and go for the Air Slash. We're not going to Dynamax yet. Okay, double switch. He goes to Jet, which is fine. Not not too much of an issue. Oh, we get some good chip. Oh, critical hit. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and just Toxic this thing. It's probably going to go Nasty Plot or Roost. But let's put this thing on a timer. We don't want this thing messing with our team too much. Okay, Ancient Power. Decent trade-off. That is fair. I I'm cool with that. Alright, I think Excel Rock doesn't... You know what? Let's go... Yeah, let's go ahead and go... Let's go Lone Wolf here. And let's just go ahead and go for the Stone Edge. I think he switches here. And even then, I still think we're faster. Okay, so he does switch. Goes back into Evergreen, which is fine. And let's hit this, please. And we do! Half damage. Alright, we're going to switch out here to Berserker. We do have Assault Vest, so we should be able to live uh, Earth Power if he goes for it. <sighs> okay, good, 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 good drain. Even better. And we're going to go for the U-turn here. I think he's going to... If he stays in, we can switch out to somebody. I forget who we have left. If he stays in, we have a switch in. And if he switches out... Okay, so he stays in. Assault Vest coming in clutch. So, Berserker doing the good thing here. It's not choice. And let's go ahead and go for the Stone Edge. You know what? I think it's Dynamax already. Yep, I'm gonna play it safe and not risk the miss. Max Rockfall. Ooh, who does he go in here? Obsidian. Alright, so he goes the Umbreon. So we're gonna get some really good chip damage off on this thing. 
Hopefully we can do at least half damage. Oh, fuck. Okay. Sorry, I was watching the Patriots game and I thought they were going to throw a flag for blocking the back. Whew. So, Lone Wolf with the max rock fall. Let's see how much this does. Please do over half. And it does. Wonderful. And honestly, I think we go for max knuckle here. It will take it out. And we'll be plus one attack. So far, so good. We're in a very good position right now. Let's hope we can stay that way. Okay, so he withdraws Obsidian and goes into Jet, which is fine. Don't think Max Knuckles is going to be knocking it out, though. Yeah, definitely not. But we did get our attack race. Okay, Jet was hurt by poison. And we're going to go for the max still spike to get our special defense up. Oh, no, wait. It's just regular defense. But we're going to get our defense up. It's not too bad. All right, so we got sand on our side. Let's see who he decides to go out to here. Our special defense should be double since it's in the sand. So I think we could take a priority Giga Drain. I mean, I'm not going to switch out. So, I mean, it's going to be a risk we're going to have to take. Alright, so Astra comes in here. Alright, Iron Head it is. We got Sand up. Our special defense is boosted. Can we live it? Oh, we do, baby. We definitely do. And I think plus one, even with that berry, we should take this thing out. No, we don't. Interesting. Question is, do we live another one? You know what? Even if we don't, we go to Chowder, we Shell Smash, I mean, we uh, Belly Drum. Oh, it doesn't have the right item on it. Shit. Oh, well, we still Belly Drum, and then we try to sweep from there. You know what? Let's just excel rock. I don't know if... Yeah, Giga Dream's still gonna go first. Damn it. I should have thought of that. It's fine. Like I said, this come phase is a bane of my existence. So it's gonna be... It's gonna be an issue. But we should be able to live any hit from this thing. You know what? I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to go play rough here. Because the just the fact that it has priority, it's going to screw me over. I should have had Citrus Berry on this. I don't know why I had Focus Sash. Okay, so there's that.
I should have belly jumped. Damn it. Alright, Berserker, let's go. Switch out, AV. Let's see what happens. I think I just threw there, guys. Okay, let's see. We have Iron Head, so we're going to go for that. I think I just threw the game because I didn't belly drum. I could have belly drummed there. Went synthesis. Does it switch out? If it switches out, that could be a good thing. Not a great thing, because then I don't know what I'll do to this thing later. Okay, so it switches out and goes to Evergreen here. And I believe we knocked this thing out. And we do! Now who does he go to? does he go to good thing is we still have our assault vest and most of his Pokemon in the back are special attackers all right Ryzen we're gonna go to Goddard obviously it's the obvious thing we're gonna do and it's probably lightning rod this time around But man, not having Citrus on my Pokemon has really fucked me over. And Berserker is pretty much needed for the Comfey. So I can't risk uh, losing too much damage here. He sure is taking time to pick this move though. Is he going to go for a double? Because honestly, that'd be really smart on his part. No, he stays in. So we got Goddard. Maybe he was contemplating. Yeah, he was contemplating. Alright, we're going to go Hyper Voice. See how much that does. We are modest specs, max special attack, so should do a good chunk. Okay, it does half. Go surf. Very interesting. But we take that. So we'll get the knockout on Ryzen. Then, oh, okay, no, he switches. Obsidian comes in. And we don't get the knockout on that. But we're faster and should get it on this next turn. Three minutes left in this battle. So judging by how much time he's taking to pick these moves, it's going to come down to timer. <sighs> Let's see. I mean, we have health on him. 
So honestly, he should be trying to go for a kill or something. Okay, protect. Can we get the knockout here though? That's the question. We should. Two minutes left in the battle. Again, he should really be going for kills. But interesting, interesting choice. Come on, dude, just pick the move. Okay, so he gets a double protect. So now he for sure lives the hit. Hyper voice. Oh no, he goes down. Critical hit. Perfect. He got the double protect, so I got the critical hit. It's fair. Alright, and I don't like doing this, but I'm not going to pick a move because the, the last battle, he could have played it out with this Togekiss, and he didn't. So I'm just going to take the win here. GG Devin. It's a great match, man. Great playing against you. And, uh, you know, it was fun to play you, man. Play you twice. So, GG, man. Hopefully you do good in your other uh, draft league you're doing right now. The doubles draft league you're doing. So, if y'all like doubles draft, go ahead and check out Devin's uh, team over there in that league. And... That's pretty much it, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys in the championship round.